Hey everybody, Moon Mama here, and today I'm finally doing June's horror block. Uh, my sci fan block has not come in yet, but the horror block came in today, so I figured I might as well get it done. So, uh, they sent out a letter letting everybody know it was going to be late. They explained why, stuff like that, yada, 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 yada. <clears throat> so it's just really, really late. Uh, July's will be following this one really closely. So, usually they're pretty good, and they're not usually late. I get mine usually around between the 20th of each month to the 25th, in and around there usually, so it's not too, too bad. Um, as always, I'm going to put the information down in the description below, so you can go ahead and click it, like, and get it, because it's always awesome. Uh, I absolutely love the uh, horror block. So excited to finally get it. Dig right in and get this plastic off. Which is perfect for a day like today because it is rainy out. So I love that they do this stuff. My box doesn't get soap. So. Open it up. Sneak peek, that's all you get. So first things first is the t-shirt. Apparently I just do something out. An obey, nice little zombie face. That's a nice t-shirt. I do like that. So I'll take out the item. So the pin this month comes in an actual, like, coffin. That's kind of cool. Open it up, and <laughs> that is nice. I do like that, that it came in a coffin for a vampire head. And it's a detailed coffin, too. It's not just, like, a cheap cutout. That's pretty cool. So always, it's double-packed, so it's not going to fall around and turn upside down on the lampshade or your shirt or jacket or wherever you put it, because everybody's different. As you can see, I put mine up here. I do have to get the other one started because that one's getting full. Let's see what this big item is. Vince Price Limited Edition Mini Bust. Produced by Rue Morgue Magazine. Oh, that is cool. I'm getting it, I'm getting it. Ugh. And it can hang on your wall. There's the back of it. Ready? Ready for the reveal? There he is. In his Dracula glory. That is so awesome. It's a nice figure. That is actually pretty cool. I love the detail. I don't know how well you can see that face on here, but... Like... That's a pretty detailed face. That's like really nice. So, definitely love this. Uh, let's see what our DVDs are. Stake Land 2, Death is No Escape. Hmm. I love these cheesy, not heard of much horror movies. I always find they're actually really, really good and underrated. And you look at the back there and like look at that guy's face. So I'll definitely be checking this out. So I can't wait to see. I love those kind of movies because they're not really out there or known about. And then you get them and they're better than you expect. And they're they're great little cheesy horror movies sometimes. Night of the Lone Wolf. I can say I actually haven't seen either of these movies, so it'll be interesting to see how well they actually are. Oh, 
itchy eye all of a sudden, sorry. Oh, I have like this really cool geeky get pen collection going, but this is going to be my favorite. This is awesome. It's a little sad that this is what the Gremlins item was. Like, I would have preferred a stuffy or something, a plushy, but look at his little sad face. Even he's shaggy drawn a pen and not a stuffy. But still, just a nice weighted pen. I'm not sure how well it writes. I don't have paper near me. I'll use the styrofoam. Seems to write pretty good. I didn't do anything fancy. Just a doodle. So that's not bad. And then, of course, we have our Rumor book. The Evil Within. So that's pretty awesome. I love getting these magazines. I'm trying to find a nice page, like just some of the stuff that's in it. My uh, one niece actually uh, is going to have to get around to borrowing all these and getting caught up. She has a bunch at home, but I have so many from this box, so. There's like a huge thing in here on in the belly of the basement. The movie that would not die. I'm not sure. But yeah, so, as always, ooh, wait, hold on, something caught my eye. Haunted Dimensions, the guy who designed some of these horror movies, the houses, I should say, like, And then of course there's that, like that alone is awesome and I can't wait to actually read that. So. There's a bunch of stuff here on Silence of the Lambs, all kinds of other stuff. So definitely look for this magazine because it's definitely worth it. Pretty awesome. Oh, there is absolutely no card. No card in this one telling me what should be in the block. Didn't even confirm that this was June's. I'm just guessing because it came first, it's June's. Doesn't say anywhere about it. But anyways, so that's my block. As always, pretty awesome. I do love my horror block. I'm going to put all the information down in the description below. So you can go ahead and click it, like it, and get it because it's awesome. Nerd Block does a great job with these, and I totally understand being late this month. They explained it. Hopefully it doesn't happen again. If it does, whatever. Um, so while you're at it, go ahead and follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Tumblr, Instagram. Follow me on the, uh, check out the Patreon. Still new at it, whatever, but yeah, check it out if you want. If not, meh, up to you. Uh, hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. Punch that like and give us a thumbs up. And while you're at it, have a good day. Bye. Hey everybody and thanks for watching. Click that like and give me a thumbs up. And while you're at it, go ahead and over and hit subscribe if you haven't already. Any and all links are in the description below. Cheers and have a good one.